Qua, come on, let. Qua, qua, come on, let. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my. It's my avocado salt and pepper shakers. It is dairy-free avocado bedding. But hello, everyone, and welcome. Yes, I'm wearing a headband that says hashtag Elfie. Not quite sure why, I'm not gonna lie. But the festivities continue! Yay! I'm actually currently sat in my dining room, but we've moved this chair that's normally in the living room into my dining room. And I wanted a bit of the tree in. So I feel like I should, I should be less in it. I should be like this, and then it should just be the tree, because the tree looks really cute. But today I'm gonna bring to you guys a gift guide. Now, I know gift guides, okay, this is annoying me, but I know gift guides can be boring. They can be samey. You're like, that's not very helpful. I'm bored. Well, I can tell you now, it's not going to be that kind of gift guide. This is S H I T you actually want for Christmas or you would get other people for Christmas. So basically, if people don't know what to get you, just send them a link to this video, and like, I I'm gonna sort them right out. Don't you worry, you'll be getting some good stuff under that Christmas tree. So this is stuff that you would either want or you'd gift to somebody else. And it's gonna be a whole host of price ranges because, yeah, we want different price brackets depending on budgets, depending on who it is. Um, the list goes onwards. So yes, I'm very, very excited. Um, I've really thought about what is going into this gift guide and I hope you guys enjoy. And I have a little fake toy Alfie sat here with me. Bit weird, but we'll just go with it. Also, my Christmas jumper is from Primark. Hopefully you would have seen my latest Primark haul and yeah, it's from there. So let's begin with the first item. Now, you guys know that I have worked with Clues this past year and I'm a huge, huge fan of their watches. Well, you know that saying like, oh, they've got something up their sleeve. Well, are we ready for this? Da -da, da -da, da -da. Yes, guys, I have gone to the effort of putting every single clue swatch I own on. I've got one, two, three, four, five clue swatches on my hand. Does that not just show to you guys the love that I have for clues? We, we all know I, I'm a huge, huge fan. Um, so, yes, I do genuinely think that a clue swatch would be an amazing gift because it is a slightly more pricier item that maybe you wouldn't necessarily treat yourself to but somebody else would and I mean I mean I've got five of them so I think we know I like them um and I might like I don't know which which one's my favorite that's impossible it's like trying to pick a favorite child but uh, this isn't the most comfortable I would not suggest necessarily wearing all five um i do actually know that they are bringing out gift boxes so if you did want to get someone um a clue swatch you could get a gift box which comes with one of the watch styles and then it also comes with straps because you can actually interchange all of these straps um so you don't need to buy a new watch every time you want a new strap it's so much more cost effective and yes i do have a discount code it's just misha grimes and you can save us some money if you want to pick up yourself or somebody else someone that you love someone that you dislike i mean if you've got someone that you don't like a clue swatch i'd be like wow what do you get someone that you like because these are beautiful but yes thank you so much to clues for working with me on this section of the video but hand on heart you guys know i'm i'm literally always wearing them what can i say so yes i will leave a link in the description box to the gift box as well as all of the different selection of watches because yeah i feel like i might put my sleeve back down and you can just see the one because maybe two <laughs> just looks a bit odd otherwise but okay the rest of the pieces that i have are actually from asos so asos were doing their black friday sales and it was 20 percent off so prior to the black friday sales i put loads of stuff in my basket because i do think asos have a huge selection of places places things that you can buy under one roof for different people and it just makes life a lot easier you have to pay for postage it's just makes life easier basically okay i feel like the first thing i need to go for from asos 
is actually avocado themed. Like, are we even surprised? But they're taking over, guys. Soon there's gonna be like avocado robots or something like that. Um, but we all know that I will be wishing for avocados under the Christmas tree. So I had to get some avocado inspo from ASOS and they had so many pieces. But first up, I have this. Now you're probably thinking like, is it an avocado photo frame? What's going on? Oh no, no. Oh, I've just had my nails redone and I don't want to ruin them with the sellotape. Oh, this is stressful. Oh gosh, my nail lady's gonna kill me. Are you ready to see what they are? Like you guys may have guessed, but it is avocado. I can't get them out. Salt and pepper shakers. Look at that little face. Now these are £8.50, definitely much more of a less expensive present price, but look, they even fit together. Imagine that, just on your dining table. People would come over and be like, what is that? And then you're like, it's my avocado salt and pepper shakers. Look, you can see the little holes. I just think these are the most adorable thing. I'm kind of tempted to keep them and give them to myself, but just imagine opening that on Christmas. I feel like you'd be like, wow. Wow, you know me so well. Like, you can salt and pepper your avocado toast with an avocado. Life made. Next up, I'm going to go to the only clothing item that I picked up. And I mean, I'm not even sure if you can count this as clothing, but it's basically a nightgown. So, this was just over £20 and... It is honestly the fluffiest nightgown I have ever held. I love nightgowns. I live in nightgowns. Like, they're just my jam. So I would love a slightly pricier nightgown. I know £20 isn't, like, a huge price, but it's still quite pricey for a nightgown. I've said nightgown about 70 times. Um, but, I mean, guys, just look. Oh my gosh, it's so fluffy. Imagine spending Christmas Day in this. Like, oh my goodness me. I know it's cream, which maybe isn't the safest colour. Um, but, you know, just stick it in the wash after you've spilt makeup down it, avocado toast down it, gravy, red wine. Not that I drink red wine. Ew. Sorry, darling. Do you know where the orange cushions are? Where did you put them? So, yes. Highly, highly recommend getting someone a nightgown for Christmas. Just like, if you've got that awkward person that has everything, I bet you they don't have a new nightgown that's super fluffy. So I thought that's a go-to. Also, you can get this for male or female, which is actually kind of relevant with a lot of the gifts that I've got. They are kind of unisex. So if you have that awkward boyfriend, brother, dad, man in your life that you don't want to get for, maybe get them a nightgown. You know, they might rub it. Rub it, love it. Next up, I've got one of these. Now this is 20 pounds, so again, similar to the nightgown, but a very different item. This is a shower speaker. I saw this and I was like, wow, that is so clever. Like, honestly, so clever. So it's wireless, it's waterproof, and it has a microphone. I am so attempted, attempted? So tempted to keep so many of these pieces, and this is definitely one of them. It's compatible with your phone, with your tablet, with your laptop, with your computer, and you literally just like suction it to the shower, and then you can have a party in the shower, because am I the only one that literally plays songs from her phone in the shower and sings along from the top of her lungs? Spotify, shower hits, should I put some on? But you can't really hear it because of the water. Well now, I can literally have a full on party. Maybe don't get this for someone that lives with you because you may not want to encourage the racket, but what can I say? My parade. And all the clubs you get in using my name. Oh my, oh my. Oh my, oh my, oh my. Oh. How about a round of applause? Yeah. Standing ovation. I'm so annoying. Anyway, that will be me tonight when I have a shower. Can't wait for it. Family, apologies. Okay, moving onwards. Now, let's 
go to a slightly more expensive makeup based item. I haven't picked out any makeup in this video because I do think it's all well and good saying, oh, I'll get the makeup. But I do think makeup is difficult to buy for people because shades, like if they have dry skin, if they have this, if they have that. But one thing that will never disappoint anyone is anything benefit. First off, let's look at the packaging. Yeah. It's adorable. So this is a magical brow stars box. I think brows are a lot, a lot easier to buy, like a gift pack for someone because they're gonna love the benefit products. Like there's a selection for them to choose from. Also, if their eyebrows are my color, they're shade three. If they're darker, they're shade four, they're lighter, they're shade two. You, you get what I mean. It should be much easier to guess the shade of someone's eyebrows than say their foundation color. Um, this did have like beautiful packaging that splayed it all out, but I actually got this a little while ago. So in the box, you have the foolproof brow powder and it's like a lighter eyebrow and then darker bit so you put the darker bit on like the edges of your eyebrow apologies if you're a male you're not into makeup and you're watching this and you're like i don't really care where i put it well you're learning then we've got the cub brow which is the brow pomade then we've got the Gimme Brow, which is like my favourite eyebrow gel. Then we've got the Precisely My Brow, which is the Skinny Brow Pencil. And then we've got the Goof Proof Brow Pencil, which is the slightly fatter one. So yes, I absolutely love Benefit products. I think they are such a good gift. So these retail for £49.50, so basically £50. So again, it is slightly more on the pricier side of presents, but it's definitely worthwhile because that's a very good price considering the fact you get five brow products. Oh, you also get an eyebrow brush, but I've lost it. Shock, horror. Also, this can then go on your like display. That's where I have it. Okay, we're gonna move on to another avocado item because I got far too many of them. Avocado bedding. Okay, I can't be the only one that loves avocados so much that they will have bedding of it. I do have some sets from Asda which are fabulous, but I wanted to try out this one because it's just so cute. Okay, I'm gonna go really close so you can see. It's hard because my ring light. But there we go, there we go. Okay, so this is bright orange bedding. It comes with two cushion covers, a quilt cover, and it's avocados riding a nacho with a pot of salsa. Not only is it avocado bedding, but it's dairy-free avocado bedding. Like, there's no cheese in that. That's brilliant. Oh, wait, they are riding, yeah, they are riding a chip, not a piece of cheese. We're all good. It's guacamole. 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 So yes, this is actually for a double. So this retails for thirty pounds. Um, I think the single. Is this a double? Is this double? Is a double. It's a double. The single is twenty-two pounds. I actually have a king size bed, but Mum tells me that I will be able to fit this on my bed. It will just like the quilt will be a bit squished. So I'm like, okay, maybe I'll have orange bedding. Don't know if it'll go in my room, but I don't really care because it's avocados. Next up, let's go to a really, really random gift, but something that everyone would want. This is also really good value for money. Pretty sure this retails for £24. And this is a waffle maker. Yes, your gal got a waffle maker. Now, I'm very unlikely to keep this however much I want to. Um, I am going to open it because I want to show you guys. Just, I don't know. I absolutely love waffles, but I just, I don't know. Will I make them? Who knows? Is it a bit excessive to buy yourself a waffle maker? Probably. Can you buy it for somebody else? Most definitely. Okay. Oh, this is hard to get out. Ow, I just hit myself in the face. Oh, it's mini. Oh, guys, I might have to keep it. This is adorable. Okay, okay. Oh my goodness me. Look at that pale blue. That is stunning. So, you just, if I could open it, how does it open? Wait, what? Ah, like that. Ah, oh, look! You can make your waffles! 
I just thought for the price, this is such a unique gift that I feel like people would actually want and use. Like imagine having breakfast on Saturday mornings or even just every morning. You know, you make your waffles. I don't think it's that difficult to make waffles. Um, so yeah, I'm digging on that. I feel like my sister would very much appreciate that as a gift. Um, I'm gonna sort out the packaging later. Let's just shove that over there. Oh. I got an itch. Another gift idea I have is water bottles. Now I know you're probably thinking like, that's such a rubbish gift, like a water bottle. Genuinely, every time I post about my water bottle, everyone asks where it's from um, because they're so useful and obviously you're not then using plastic bottles, you're not buying bottles, you're not using single use plastic. I literally have had my bottle for so long and I use it every single day. So I've got two different options here. Um, I've got this one which actually has the, what is that? 101 Dalmatians. Um, this one is a slightly bigger one and I'm pretty sure this is like eight or 10 pounds. Um, and of course it's Disney. Then it's got this little like pull up thing and mine has this and I love, and this sounds really wrong, but I love sucking on it because I'm too lazy to like pick up a cup and go like that. But I am also concerned that it might be pushing my teeth forward because it's a bit like a child having a dummy. Um, let me know if that's actually a thing, but it's still a really cute present and they're so useful for traveling. Then I also have, of course, an avocado one. So this is, oh, these are, the avocado items all seem to be from Sass and Bell. Oh, this one's actually dishwasher safe and it's BPA free. So this one is actually not one of those ooh, sucky ones. It's just a normal water bottle with a black lid, which I should definitely use. Um, but whoopsies, yes. So two different options. I'm pretty sure this one is a little bit cheaper because it's smaller, but they'll both be linked down below. So if you need someone or you know someone that needs some hydration in their life, these are the perfect gift. Also, stay tuned because there might be a giveaway of some avocado goodies at the end. Next up, I have another useful gift that you may not buy yourself, but everyone needs this in their life. Chargers are a bit of a nightmare. I always forget to charge my phone. I can't be bothered to charge my phone. It doesn't happen. Then it dies and then I need to do something on my phone. So this is a 1.5 meter charger, which was 10 pounds. This just means you can plug it in to that plug that is the opposite side of the room from you and your phone actually meet. Like you can go on your phone. I hate hotel rooms that don't have a plug next to the bed. It literally drives me crazy because I want to be able to charge my phone at night next to me in case something pops up that I need to know about or I'm that person that goes on their phone to fall asleep. I know, bad. Naughty Misha. New Year's resolution, maybe not to do that. Another homeware item is this one. I do think homeware is a brilliant thing to get as a gift because it doesn't necessarily have to uh, be a certain size or be a certain shape or a certain color. You know, it goes with everything. So whenever I film in my sister's room and I show her Hollywood mirror, everyone always asks where it's from. And I honestly don't know, but I'm pretty sure it was like 200 quid, which is very expensive. So I found this one. Now I'm pretty sure it was around like 15, 20 pounds, but I actually can't find it on the ASOS website anymore, which is really bizarre. Um, so I will find alternatives and link them down below of like inexpensive Hollywood mirrors because it's literally like that would be perfect for someone's desk trying not to blind you with the ring light. So it's just a mini version and then you pop in batteries and you turn it on and off and it literally lights up. So I think that would be so good to sit on someone's desk. Alf, you okay? Um, and you know, if you have any makeup lovers out there or selfie lovers, then this gift is for them. <coughs> Last, but by certainly not least, I have my final avocado item. And this is a avocado lunch bag. Yep, yeah, I already own a lunch box, but I don't own a lunch bag. Let's try and get to this. So here it is. I'm pretty sure this was eight pounds. 
And again, this is by Sass and Belle. I feel like I need to go on their website and see who they are because they do some good avocado stuff. And it's actually like a fridge bag. So your food can stay in here and it won't get warm. So if you do work, say in like an office or away from home or you're going on a trip somewhere, this is perfect. I absolutely love it. And like the avocados on it are the cutest avocados I've seen. So I somehow accidentally ordered two of these. And I accidentally somehow ordered two of these. Where's the other one? Here it is. So that just makes me think I have to do a giveaway. So you guys have supported me so much this year and honestly it means the world to me. So you know, I've got to share the love. So in this video I will be giving away two of these lunch bags and two of the water bottles and to enter all you need to do is subscribe to my youtube channel and give this video a like and comment down below with your favorite item from the gift guide then head on over to my instagram and give me a follow and comment on any one of my latest pictures saying hashtag Avo Merry Christmas and tag your best friend, your sister, your mum, your brother, anyone that you would like a matching lunch bag and water bottle with. So yes, you and your bestie or your friend or your, well, hopefully they're bestie or they're your friend, your sister, your mum, anyone, you two can share the goodies and yeah. That is the little giveaway for the end, just to say thank you so much to you guys. There are other, with there are other giveaways going on throughout December, so stay tuned. But yes, and also every time you comment it on a different photo on Instagram, that is another entry, and I will announce the winner in a week. So stay tuned, yes. I hope you guys have enjoyed this little gift guide. It's been lots of fun just to actually sit down and talk through items. Um, and yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you all have a fabulous, fabulous rest of the week. Have a fabulous weekend. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure this video a like and subscribe. I will link all of the items mentioned down below so you guys can shop them and check them out. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And yeah, toodle pip. I love you guys lots and I will see you all in the next one. Bye. Mm -hmm.